A hot breakfast served to a sea of blue. Officers getting French toast, hash browns, and fruit with the side of turkey bacon. We mentioned it on a Friday prayer last week, and everybody's here to help out on this day today. And this is one way actually to say thank you to these officers here that protect us. Ozzy Khalil organized the special treat, getting mosque members and 800 police officers from the neighboring 25th district together under one roof to feed them and thank them before the cops hit the streets for one of their larger events, working Philly's annual Puerto Rican Day Parade. For Ozzy, it's not just about extending a branch of friendship. It's about making roots between these officers and those who rely on them. This is the second annual, and we're going to continue to do this every year, as long as we're here. District Captain Mike Cram points out breakfast really can be the most important meal of the day. He tells a story about the mosque's efforts last year. About a month uh, after the event, I was down at court, and an officer stopped me from another district and said, hey, you know, that's the first time I ever got fed a hot meal before I went out on a van. It kind of set the tone for the whole day. Building bridges between two groups who have much in common, not least of which is the knowledge of what it's like to be defined, even vilified, by the badge you wear or the place you worship. It's a way to say we're not like that, and, you know, there's maybe could be, one, you know, one is bad, but not all of us, and we're here to say that we are the real Muslims, the good Muslims, and this is what we do in our Islam here, to communicate with our community. This is just a good way for us to, you know, for them to show that, hey, people do care about you out there. In North Philadelphia, Sabina Koreakos, Fox 29 News.